guys and um, welcome back to my channel I hope you're having an awesome day thanks so much for coming back and watching another one of my videos today's video is also going to be another how to style a biker shorts video so yeah I've been wearing biker shorts quite a bit over the past I would say month and a half this summer so far it's also another trend besides jean shorts that I never really thought I'd get into but after seeing everybody wear them so much I want to give them a try I still do think that shorts are a little bit comfier than biker shorts though so unpopular opinion here if you guys like biker shorts I'm sorry but I have had a lot of fun wearing them throughout the summer and they have been quite comfy for what I've been wearing so far so I want to share with you guys some of the outfits that I put together and to give you guys some also some tips and tricks when it comes to styling biker shorts so that you can rock them for the end of the season before fall comes along and if they're still trendy for next year at least you'll have a reference video to go look back on for next year's outfits when you want to create some new ones so without further ado let's chat a little bit about the biker shorts before we start into the outfits so biker shorts ton of different types you guys can honestly just get like workout shorts from like I don't know Adidas and Nike and wear them those work perfectly fine you can also get shorts from like Lululemon, Aritzia, Aloe Yoga as well I have a pair of biker shorts that are actually like a leather effect one. They're kind of like wrinkly right now because I had to excavate them from a pile of clothes that I currently have sitting in my bed. This is a pair that I have. This is from a brand called Commando. I actually have um, a pair of vinyl leggings from them and I created a whole video on how to like style vinyl leggings and then they saw the video. They reached out to me. They're like, we'd love to send you some stuff. I figured I don't have biker shorts. Let's try those to see how I would like them. And so now they have kindly sent me this pair of biker shorts and I have been obsessed with them because it's not your typical type of biker shorts. It's not like your workout material. It's got this kind of faux leather texture and it legit looks like leather up close, but it's faux and it's stretchy so I don't have to worry about any animals being hurt in the process of making these shorts. And also they're stretchy so it makes it easy to wear them without having to worry that I'm ruining or damaging the leather. I also want to mention that the inside is lined as well so it's not like this weird sticky material that you sometimes see with leather being super comfortable to put on and it has a very shapewear controlling surface to it. I believe Commando is primarily a shapewear or hosiery company. So first came stockings and just kind of like body shapewear, I guess. I don't know what you call that category. And then second came fashion shapewear, which would be like the vinyl leggings, just like liquid leggings in general. And now pleather biker shorts. So I have a pair of these. I don't have the athletic version, which is kind of like workout material just quite yet. I do still want to get a pair of those ones though just because I do find that those breathe a little bit better than these ones. Although these ones are very very comfy for me to put on, I do find that the material doesn't breathe as well and I tend to get a little bit hot when I'm wearing them. So I want to pick up a pair of like workout leggings style biker shorts, like actual biker shorts designed for people who are biking, just to compare and see if they're comfier than these ones and maybe at that point I might like biker shorts more than my shorts. So let's chat a little bit about biker shorts and how to style them in different ways to wear them before we jump right into the outfits. So when it comes to biker shorts, because they are supposed to be the epitome of comfort and style when it comes to summertime, I get really, really lazy with my outfits. Honestly, the majority of the time, I love pairing this together with like a really nice boxy tee. If you guys have seen in the past, I love wearing graphic tees that you may have seen in some of my previous videos. So I'll honestly, just throw on a pair of these shorts with graphic tee on top and then just some sneakers and then head out. That's like a casual day for me to walk Kobe, run errands, go pick up some food and groceries or just grab a whole tee in general. If I do want to amp it up a little bit and get a little bit more dressy, I like to wear these shorts with a crop top and an oversized blazer over top. I think that gives it a very nice kind of chic street style look. That's the trendy look right now and I personally love it. It's super comfy. Love a blazer because it gives me pockets to throw things into. These shorts unfortunately do not have pockets so I have nowhere to put my keys and my presto pads besides my purse if I'm carrying one. But if I have a blazer then I can toss it into those pockets and life is peachy keen. And if I do want to step up a little bit and go less street style and less casual and go a little bit more dressy, I have some like nicer crop tops that I like to pair with these biker shorts to kind of give it a more of a going out vibe. I am not somebody who likes wearing skirts when I go out at nighttime just because, I don't know, I feel like it just, it's too easy access for the creepos out there at the club. I've had too many times where I've walked into a club and a guy just tries to like wrap my ass with a skirt. Granted, that's not going to stop him wearing shorts, but at least I feel a little bit more secure when I have shorts that are like literally bound tight against my legs so he can't do anything creepy under there. I like to pair my biker shorts with like cute crop tops. I had somebody ask me in one of my previous videos how I would wear vinyl leggings to a club. Honestly guys, I probably wouldn't wear vinyl leggings to a club just because it's so freaking hot. Even in this winter time when it's cold outside and we get like really frigid cold weather here, I would probably just wear a skirt or these biker shorts and then cab to the club and get out and go in from there. 
I'm not trying to keep myself extra warm outside so that when I go into the club I'm boiling hot because those vinyl leggings do not really breathe like a lot more than these ones and I sweat like crazy underneath them which is great when I'm outdoors in the winter time but as soon as I'm indoors it's like uh -uh, end of story way too hot for me so if you want an alternative and you kind of want to still get that vinyl look you can definitely scoop up this style biker shorts it's very similar to leather leggings as well pleather leggings um, and wear this to the club with a cute little crop top you can wear a basic crop top. I love the tee look, which is like a simple straight across cut with like very simple straps going across the top here. There's some really nice ones online as well too that I've seen at like Aritzia and Revolve that have really cool crisscrosses in the back, which adds that extra detail beyond like a very color blocky rectangular look. Or you can go extravagant with your crop top. I have some like beaded ones that I think look so cute with this. It adds that like extra sparkle. I think juxtapose as well against a very athletic silhouette. So that's always fun. And then pairing along with the biker shorts, because the whole like 90s low heel trend is very popular right now, when it comes to a club, I like to pair that with my outfit so I have a very comfortable look. I'm not trying to go to a club with six inch stilettos and breaking my ankles as I'm drinking alcohol throughout the night. And I can't remember how to walk anymore, so low heels, biker shorts, a cute crop top, that is like my go-to party outfit for now, because it's literally the epitome of comfort, and I don't think you can get any more comfortable than that, besides just wearing pajamas and staying at home. So chatted way too much with you guys now let's jump right in to the 10 different outfits that i've styled together with the biker shorts and i'll show you the different styles that i would personally wear them so you guys can get some more info as well into this video guys I had so much fun creating all these different outfits with the biker shorts I'm definitely gonna be using this video as a reference and an inspo for myself the next time I wake up first thing in the morning and I don't know what to wear but I know I want to wear biker shorts and as I said I use these videos all the time for myself as well as inspo when I'm at a loss for my outfits so I hope it serves you a purpose as much as it serves me one because it definitely helps me but otherwise thanks so much for watching and coming back to my channel guys if you're not already part of the fam make sure you subscribe so you know every single time I upload a brand new video other than that I hope you guys have an awesome day and I'll see you guys next time bye